Okay, so for those of you that get motion sick, maybe just listen to me, do something around the house while I'm doing this. This is going to be my updated makeup collection, okay? And I did one of these this year in my makeup collection, and you will find that that's a bunch of pencils. I'm going to talk about things. Um, you will find that I actually have downsized considerably because of EDIV, giving stuff away, and all that. Um, so I'm just going to go through now... Um, I'm just going to put it down this so I could talk and you don't have to stare at weird things. I follow Faithers K on here. She does watch my videos sometimes. If you are watching, hello girl. Um, I hope you have a Merry Christmas to you and all your boys. Um, she's amazing and I just recently watched a video of hers. I think it was from maybe last week I was catching up um, about... 2015 and just like how much she purged in 2014 and not being wasteful using our things you know and I've said this before you know the average woman has a makeup bag similar to something like the size like this and she has a few things in there just as much as like she uses it to its completion and then she buys something new now those of us on YouTube obviously don't have that now my collection now after it's been downsized so much is very small considered to people on YouTube but I think for an average Average woman I probably still have about six seven eight times what normal people have and it's also a lot of things take a while to go through um, so I'm going to go through everything once again if you get motion sick just listen to what I have to say I'm going to talk about the products very briefly and um, let's get started so I do have a backup um, concealer which I got for like a dollar or something at Ulta um, or maybe dollar fifty on a sale. These are Urban Decay, A Book of Shadows, um, all of these ones on the inside depotted, and then um, the ones on the outside are an old Ulta palette. And so that's two palettes. I have tons of mascara and stuff in the original packaging. I have um, Maybelline, Elf, Revlon, the Butterfly, which I just got. It's the intense one page I'm going to be trying soon. A mineral wear eyeliner and then another lip gloss. Those two on the end might end up going in a giveaway. Those are MAC pigments. And then an old Urban Decay Shattered, which I love. This is this was sentimental. This is very sentimental to me. I used to wear this when I was younger. This is Jane eyeshadow. And when I saw them going out of business, I think I got this for like 50, 60 cents. I haven't used it. It's actually gorgeous. And it seems really intense, but I'll have to maybe try to wear it as like a my makeup when I was younger kind of video. I got just one. Uh, two different Bare Minerals uh, foundations. They're phenomenal. When I wanted to use it, then I have what I need. Two brow sets. Um, this was from Paige from Swap, and that is something that I purchased. I'm finishing my brow liner, and then I'm going to switch to that. I'm very close to finishing. Two high-end um, foundations, which I actually got for a quarter a piece, and they're actually my color in spring, summer, fall-ish. Not necessarily right now. Um, I would use my Bare Minerals, so I have those. This, I just, um, that's a MAC lip palette, and then this I just got as a gift. I'm going to be posting that haul, um, and it has another liner in there. You guys know I love those liners. I have the Urban Decay Ammo palette, and then this duo I saved for the brown here because I don't have it, um, and this is, sorry it's so dirty, um, this is from a swap from Paige as well. This is the only blush I own, and it's the only blush that looks good on me, and it's the e.l.f. one. And um, this, I'm almost done with. This will be an empty soon, Urban Decay Primer Potion. Then these are some lip products. There's more in the next row, but this is the Wet n Wild. This is like a Birds of Bees dupe. It's actually pretty good. Tons of, you know, some MAC lipsticks, another MAC lipstick. A lot of these things I keep just when I want to do a certain look, but I've considerably downsided my lip products. Um, Pop Beauty, this was from an Ipsy Hello Kitty uh, MAC. I love these from Bath and Body Works. Um, this, we're, oh, I have another, I have two more of these lip jellies that are in my purse. Elf Matte Lip Gloss. These I was just talking about. Um, I love these Essence ones. Couple Elf um, Hyper Shines, which I really love, and this Pow Perfector, which is amazing. Then I have this NYX. I haven't used this. Um, Butter Gloss I got in a swap the girl never used. And then these are my backups of my Urban Decay Perversion Deluxe samples. A Philosophy Cinnamon Bonds. These are some primers. It's Sephora, Wet n Vile, Fergie, and an Elf. Stila Moisturizer, I need to finish. Some Baby Lips. 
that's elf. This is Mac. That's a mini, another Mac. This is an eyeshadow. I don't know why I put it in here. The NYX ones, I love these. This I just got in the Walmart box and it's gorgeous. Bare Mineral Shadow. This is a MAC Tender Tone. It's a lip balm. This I'm almost done with is the Urban Decay Sin um, Primer Potion. Highlighter from Ipsy. This is the stuff that um, my thing is going to die pretty much. These are all the things that I need to finish or use. Now these are my Wet n Wild trios. You guys know about that. These are things. This is the Buxom kit that I got for $10 from Black Friday. I need to try and use. Essence Brow Pencil. Um, this is the Kat Von D eyeliner I just purchased. This is the Pixie eyeliner from my Ipsy. I'm finishing this Revlon concealer, finishing my Divina brow. So I'm working through things. And then I have a Kat Von D eyeliner. And then I have all these Urban Decay um, pencils as well as that one in this set. So I have a ton. But this is in um, Ransom. And it's a full size. And then this is a Deluxe Velvet. I haven't tried this. And then these two... This I use all the time. This one's almost gone. It'll be in an empties. And then I'm almost done with this perversion as well. So those, this is, and this doesn't include my brushes, but this is my collection right now. This is what I have. Um, and honestly, this is all I need. I don't need a ton of those fancy palettes. I do have a $50 off, so I'm probably going to purchase the Vice um, two or three, I can't remember. Um, but for the most part, like, I really don't need anything. Um, and a lot of these some of these things might go in a giveaway in the future. Um, so this is what my new collection looks like and I'm perfectly happy with it and it's manageable and it's practical and you know I'm still going to buy things but I'm going to really try not to. So I will be taping a video talking about my goals, beauty goals and product empty goals for 2015 very soon. I will talk to you guys later. Sorry if I made you dizzy. Bye.